Baritones, my name is Jeff Rolka. I want to thank you for checking out my video. This is a daily warm-up. I haven't done one of these in some time. It's pretty fast paced. Not really going to talk once we get into it. I'm going to thank you now if you've chosen to subscribe. If you haven't yet, I hope you will. Uh, and there are ways to support my channel. You can find those in the description. They do include Patreon, where you can get MP3s or even these guides if you want of this lesson. To begin with, May, 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 and May, 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 May.
now moving much closer to the secondo passaggio, or even perhaps on top of it. Then with chords. Beginning right there.
Now we're going to go over the secundo passaggio, commonly thought of as the break, beginning with the lip trill, baritones. <laughs> If you can do the super lip trill, I'd encourage you to try that too. Right here. Ready? And.
And I know that's not a ton of super low range stuff for you bass baritone folks out there, but I wanted to get a little bit of it in there just the same. This is largely a study in the wider vowels, ahs, os, if that's not apparent from the vowels that we did in the video and getting them focused and also a study in hovering right in that zona de passaggio, secondo passaggio area of our voices. The secondo passaggio being the, the break. That's the secondo passaggio is what it's called when you look at bel canto texts and things like that. So that's the area that this was primarily working on and studying in and all that kind of stuff. I do hope it helps. My name is Jeff. Thank you so much for watching. Take really good care of your voices. Enjoy singing and hopefully we'll see you again. Bye.